That was a super butch period. Oh, it was very heavy. Well, it was the other side for me. I mean, you see, I was uh, always the star out in front, the, the, the face of the band who stood there and sang his bit with his hands behind his back. And in Melbourne, I discovered that it was quite a flash to be a part of a band and actually contribute to the musical arrangements other than just singing the lyrics. And I completely changed. I mean, I got into a lot of acid in those days, a hell of a lot. And it was before it was a big thing here. I did something, I think, around 500 trips at one stage. 500 trips? Yeah, that's all told. I haven't had any since the, since the early, very early 70s. But from 68 to 69, I saw a lot of Paisley. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it was very good for me. It was a very, very big community in Melbourne that was getting into it. And it really changed my whole head around. It made me really see uh, the values of music and um, that I really wanted to be in it for the rest of my life. And the what I was doing was nothing. You know, to me is uh, more responsibility than a marriage even. I mean, it's incredibly tight when you live with guys for two or three years and uh, you, the responsibilities to five other guys in a group it become too heavy when it's a really cooperative, tight band. Have you ever sustained a long relationship with a woman? Are you living with any at the moment? Yeah, well, I, um, I'm not married. I don't believe in the holy institution of marriage. I never have. Um, I was engaged and having a, a okay. five-year affair 
But Jackie Holm, who, who yeah. I'm, I guess you know. Uh, she's been model. Well, she still is. Yeah. In fact, I see quite a lot of Jackie. She's done very well overseas, and we're very, very good friends. Even still, I've known How her for 10, now? 12 years. Well, I have uh, my lady. I don't like to call my wife. Um, and so she met... is my best, absolutely my best friend, absolutely the best person I know. Uh, she's been the best influence on me a, as a person in my career, along with my little daughter, Rusty. I have a three uh, years and three month old daughter, Rusty, who really is the light of my life. I mean, uh, I don't know why I don't have 12 kids, because I think I would like to surround myself with kids. I like, um, I like uh, what I have. I think I'm very lucky. I've been very fortunate, you know.